found this race in Iceland called the Volcano Ultra. It's the first year that they're hosting it, 280 kilometer self-sufficient multi-day stage race across the country. I'm like, this looks really cool. So basically you're carrying all your own weekly supply of food, minimum survival gear, uh, medical equipment, running clothes on your back. But I wanna take on things that scare me that I'm not comfortable with. Honestly, I feel like by taking on stuff that's new or you're not necessarily good at, it's gonna make you a much stronger and smarter runner. So I just wanna give a huge shout out to one of my sponsors, Now Foods, for fueling me uh, while training for the Volcano Ultramarathon over the last few months. And one of my favorite things, quinoa spaghetti, gonna throw some in a pot tonight. I think I'll top it with some veggies and salmon to have one last healthy home-cooked meal before I leave for Iceland tomorrow and I'm literally surviving on oatmeal and instant mashed potatoes for a week. Hey guys, Rachel here. So here's my little tent that I've been staying in throughout the weekend and I'm gonna be sleeping in throughout all the stages. So super excited, the race starts tomorrow. Just hanging out, getting to know all the other athletes. There's so many really cool people here. Oh man, I can't believe I'm doing this right now. About to run through the geyser. <laughs> oh, this is insane. <laughs> Iceland Volcano Ultramarathon complete. That was the most epic experience of my life. Uh, let me tell you, uh, from running across volcanoes to geysers, to up steep mountain passes, I've just learned so much about myself. I've become a lot more adaptable, resilient, and for that I'm grateful. See you guys soon.